Hey everyone, another early morning. Doug's already in the Nova, fired up. Wally's getting ready to go. And we're gonna hit the road early, try to get to Great Bend, crack off some passes and get the heck out of there, get to the last day. So today is day number four. Let's hit the road. Quick trip to the Waffle House this morning. Time to get on the road. Chad's got the directions and uh, there they are. The real directions. The real directions. Set up, ready to rock. I'm ready to go. Ooh, this is sick. Cruising down the road in a big old blower car. <laughs> that is awesome. Chad's getting them shots. Get on that motion YouTube channel for those chat shots. What's up? Oh, yeah. Woo! What's happening? How's it going? We seen her back there. That must be Wally. Yep. kid in this car is just awesome. They have so much fun. He does it with his dad. All right, we made it to the checkpoint. Got to get that picture. Nailed it. All right, we can move on to the next one now. Checkpoint complete, Chad. Got our picture. So we just got done taking a little pit stop. Doug had to check over some things on the car. Wally, well, we just had to turn the AC up a little bit higher. Got a, got a fresh drink. Chad got one. Yeah, I want to clean his dues from the cooler. Oh, Hope he doesn't mind. <laughs> ice cold dew. So we uh, have, I think, another 60 some miles. It's, it's a bit of a trip here today. They all kind of have been. That's Ooh. sick. Uh, but anyway, cool car outside the window. Got to stop and appreciate <laughs> it when you see a good car. Anyway, going to try to get into Great Bend. The nap, I think, builds nitrous bottles. So top off our bottle. We're good on the bottle we have, but for Tulsa, it takes care of that. Uh, try to find some nitrous jets, turn it up from a 150. That's what's in the car now. A 175, I think I'm just gonna try to squeeze it in there. The fuel jet's a little bit richer to help out with the tune since you can't tune on this thing. So uh, 05 and newer are what you can do with uh, HP tuners. So a few little things to do. Just trying to try to squeeze in 1299 zone, but also gotta make it back to Tulsa and then to Iowa after that. Lots more miles still cover, but we really want to see this thing go 1299s. Out of power, need to go faster, bigger jets. That's the key. Final checkpoint, day number four. We're at, what is this, Kansas? Yeah, we're at Kansas. Nice and warm. Doug's Nova is killing it. No problem, huh? Nope. Streetcar life. Streetcar life, man. All right, guys, while he's here, these uh, airplanes got to take a little photo. Get back on the road. Made a quick pit stop at Napa here in Great Bend. We made it, got the nitrous bottle filled up. And uh, so we only have one pass on that bottle. And then this one will be fresh for if maybe later today or tomorrow so we can finish this week off. Getting the car unloaded, we showed up here at Great Bend. If you guys remember, Great Bend was where the fuel pump issues started getting to us on Clyde during race week, the first one this year. Uh, so we were hoping that this could have been our 1199 and Clyde didn't quite work out. So we're back here. Kind of cool. It's like an old runway that you're parked on here. Uh, gonna get the wheels and tires on Wally. We do. So we showed up here a little bit late. It's already like five o'clock. Um, long drive today. So we're gonna go ahead and just set Wally up like he normally does. Run him. Get a good baseline. If it looks like we could possibly get that 12, might start looking for some uh, nitrous jets and might probably start looking for some anyway. And then this is like the worst elevation. So chances are today will be the slowest pass that Wally might make. Hopefully not though, uh, but we're gonna go up there and find out. See how the rest of the day goes. Doug made it in the Nova too. He's over there getting everything prepped, trying to knock off another seven second pass. So can't wait to see him do that. And then it should be a good day. All right, here we go. Bottles at over a thousand. Tires are a little lower than they have been. Just trying little things to refine it. Try to see if we can get a little better 60. It's hot. I think the DA is not as good here at Great Bend. But we're gonna uh, give it a run and see what happens. No problem, here we go.
a win, though. Got us a win against that Mustang. All the way out here getting it done for the 4.6 world. I actually felt like it tripped the tire just a little bit on the takeoff. See what he ran. Moment of truth. I know the mile an hour is similar like it always is. Thank you. 13.16 at 100.68 miles an hour. 13.16, so, so close. Gosh, dang it. All right, we gotta go find some jets. Man, that's, 13.16. <laughs> Guys, hopefully you can see that. 13.16 at, finally, broke 100 mile an hour. The bottle pressure's up, uh, so that probably helped it out quite a bit. So what, what a deal there, 13.16. Even faster, Chad. Hell Even yeah. faster. That was awesome. 13.16 at 100.68 miles an hour. Yeah. We broke the 100 and we are 16. We are 16 hundreds away from a 12.99. Get it. Do it. We got to get it. Why, so why it just go right back. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I don't know. It's probably the the bottle pressure is definitely higher here. The air is pretty good. It actually sp it felt like it spun just a hair on the launch. I think we just need to see if we can find just a slightly bigger nitrous jet and slide this thing into the 12s. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Appreciate it. Are you having fun? Awesome. All the ice, the AC, very nice. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it even snows now. 13, 16 in the marquee. Almost a 12. Wow. We're getting closer. Wow, good job. We're getting closer. Okay, you got some snow on your head. It's perfect. It looks like I'm at, uh, I feel like I'm, like, you know, in the Bahamas right now. Right. Here we go. Let's see if Doug can crack off another seven. guys fresh jets are installed is this it chad i really hope so I'm i hope so too yeah it's gonna be good so everybody's been asked kind of the mods you know we kind of ran out of some things to mod we've been just trying to dial in the tune-up that we had and after you know five models i think it can hold a little bit more nitrous hopefully we'll knock on that wood grain dash like this hold on chad chad i'm gonna need you to knock on this wood grain let's get a good Get a good solid knock on that. Uh, yep, all right. So, knocked on the wood. And uh, we're going to go see if we can send this thing. Red, where'd you get that seat, man? It was just here. <laughs> it was just here. It looks real similar to... Oh. Oh, what? I didn't have nowhere to sit. Jeez. I didn't have nowhere to sit, and that's a race car. Isn't You're doing it? your part in helping it go 12s. Race car's got one seat. One driver, seat. Full Wally race mode. Is straight race mode now. We thought he was in race mode. Three quarter race mode <laughs> yeah. Straight race mode. Straight race mode. <laughs> Chad's got his new seat fired up back here. Just... So comfy. <laughs> uh, so totally safe. Passenger seat completely gone. And now we're going to go up there and try to knock down a 12. Throw in just about everything else we got. We might have just a little bit more in store if we need it, but I mean, if it's going to happen, this should be it right here. Weather's coming down. Nitrous is turned up. Man, I'm ready. You ready, Chad? I'm so ready. <laughs> Let's see this thing ready. See Wally go 12s here. Here we go. We can go 12s right here. Let's go. Come on.
pressure and everything so <laughs> let's get up there get our slip see what we did felt like felt good to the 60 felt about the same up top so hopefully we picked up a little little down low see how we did here thank you dang it 1311 with a three it didn't pick it picked up barely any. It went a 13.16 earlier and there it went a 13.11. Dang it, so close. 13.11 at 100. Definitely picked up the 60. 177 to the 60. Man, so close. Wally is definitely coming around, but unfortunately just not quite enough to get that 12. It's, it's Everything's picking up down low, just no power up top on this thing. Uh, so even with the bigger jets it didn't quite pick up, we might have a little bit bigger jet that we can go on the nitrous side. So Tulsa is a little better air, but I don't know, it ran its fast pass for sure here. So it's, it's a kind of a hard call, uh, but I think we're gonna load up, make that final drive. And then if we have to send a little more at it tomorrow, at least we complete the week and try to get that 12 for sure. Um, but I guess we'll just have to find out. Tomorrow, unfortunately for today, so close. 13 11 with a three pretty much a tenth of a second is what we're missing here so close good job wally we are done here wally is ready to hit the street again and pull out all the stops tomorrow do anything we can to get this thing in the 12s hopefully the weather will cooperate with us and give us some good air because we need it all to try to go 12s in wally but we're going to give it everything we got and uh we're going to make it happen i think so thanks for watching guys if you want to see more content hit that subscribe button see you next time Ready to go eat, Chad? What? Can't even see him. It's so dark out here. There he is. Look at that. <laughs> Let's go eat, huh? Hell yeah, I'm ready. All right. <laughs> no, I'm ready me for too. that steak. Oh, finally. Yeah. Look at Chad over here just killing the photo game. Trying to get, trying to get some of these dark pictures. Light? No light? No light. No, no light. light. It looks cool like this. Hold on. Pretty cool. Oh, Chad. <laughs> I can be a little closer. That's pretty sick. <laughs>